All right, we're over here with Nick Zerlean, Zerlean Enterprises. They uh, were responsible over here at Granergy, just north of Jeff, Illinois, to put up a 50-foot flagpole on top of a 144-foot tower. So up here we got a 144-foot tower. Tell us a little bit about how you coupled or tied this flagpole, this 50-foot pole, to the top of this tower. We had a machine shop take a, a six inch solid brown stock and weld a one inch thick plate to it which we then had hot dip galvanized and then dropped it down inside the tower where we could then bolt the flagpole to it so we dropped it down in there flew the flagpole up bolted it down to that corner of the tower and then attached our our two stays to the other two corners of the tower to give it some additional bracing to take the, the load pressure off of that one particular corner and that was it in a nutshell. Now, how do you get the flag up there? Can you tell me we've about got that? Uh, we've got a 200 foot halyard that comes all the way down to the ground where you can actually change the flag from the ground. It takes about two people to get it raised up there and really lock down into place where you want it to go. Just because it's not very windy down here, but up there it's probably 15 to 20 mile an hour almost all the time. Very seldom is that flag just straight straight down. So, yeah. well, you're talking about like a 300 plus square foot sail up there. You find what? 12 by 18. 12 by 18. 12 by 18. Sometimes uh, 15 to 25. Yeah. So that's a big sail. It looks, it looks really good, and everybody that's really seen it has been duly impressed with with the flag, and the flagpole, and the material of the construction and everything. It's been a, a great project. I'm yeah. really glad it's doing the job, and uh, thanks for talking to us. No problem. Job well done. Thanks, Mike. You are the man.